So what we have is the Ichikai 09 Robot Exhibition and, and Workshop. We had a, a number of focus areas this year uh, pertaining to the, the intersection of robotics and artificial intelligence. We tried to figure out what are the things that we need to do next towards making robots become effective collaborators for humans pursuing their endeavors. Robots have to be able to affect their environment, so we need to be able to manipulate the world. They need to be able to coordinate with other robots and coordinate with other humans to be effective parts of a team. There's analogies between robotics right now and personal computing. In the scheme of things, robotics is at the stage where personal computing was about 30 years ago. Robotic is at the very beginning. It's a new industry. And uh, if it could become a standard, that would be great. What you need, similar to a computing operating system, you would like to have a robot operating system. You can then write the applications that people want for the robotic system. So me, as somebody who wants to write something interesting for a robot, I will interface with the, with the operating system and that will interface with the hardware so that I can plug and play different types of robotic backends or different types of devices the same way that I can put in different USB devices, I can put in different hard drives and memory cards and graphics cards and my applications can work with that because there's that operating system in the middle. If we had a platform that is shared by many people, we can have a much wider community working on these problems that are very difficult. I come with complete software and I'm fully programmable. The robots that you can see five to ten years from now will be able to pick up things and start to do the tasks that humans usually do in their daily lives, but do them in a way that the human doesn't necessarily have to be involved in that process. That improves my quality of life and the quality of life for everybody across society.